What's up guys, it's your boy Darksukia, and today I have some more SD Gundam battle lines for you. And today I'm going to show you how to unlock K Gundam. I call it K Gundam because I cannot say Kersharshia. Yeah, it sounds weird when I say it. But overall, today I'm going to show you how to get her. Two, there are three blueprints for this. And they're the second blueprints, a little like, a little sneaky how to get those, to be honest. Because I really didn't even know until I looked it up. But hey, let's go ahead and start off with the first blueprint. So the first blueprint is going to be in a break mission. And you are fighting uh, basically Banshee. And uh, you're, you'll have Kershashia with you also. So all you got to do is really beat the break mission for Scapegoat on Directory 7. Uh, recommendation level is 36. And this is not a too bad uh, mission. But you're getting to basically most of the in-game stuff. So Directory 7 is pretty far to get the first blueprint. And you need a total of 5 for the first blueprint. Now the second blueprint. The second blueprint is going to be in Directory 7 also. It's beyond the mobile universe. And this one is pretty weird. Because I didn't even know that you had to destroy 4 generators. So make sure you guys destroy these four generators and then I also have a clip of all the generators and the door that you want to go to alright guys so once you clear first thing you must do is defeat the first boss before you go to that next checkpoint then you want to destroy all four generators around the map then there's an area where I'm standing right now on the map where this big 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 area is here will be It'll open once you destroy all four generators, and then you'll go in here. Then you'll have a whole different boss fight here. And then when you hit defeat Gato, you will get the second blueprints for Kosharshia. All right, and the last blueprint, blueprint number three, is going to be on Stella, and the recommendation level is going to be 32. Uh, the amount of keys that you're going to need for this is three, and for hard, you'll need six. Uh, literally, the map is only two big spots left. The flag that you go to is basically the end boss, but there's another solid big area that you want to go to, and that's where you'll fight Psycho Gundam, and that's where the last um, Krasharshia parts that will drop right there. All right, we have the K Gundam Krasharshia. Like <laughs> I can't even say it, but Sharpshooter. I'm pretty sure this is a really good uh, Sharpshooter from the jump, just by the move set I'm seeing here. Now let's talk about the stats from level one. Um, we have 326. The boost is 115, and then the melee is 147, and then the range is 194. Now, uh, the damage cut rate, physical melee is 6.32, range is going to be 11.59, beam melee is going to be 746, and beam range is going to be 1387. That's pretty high for the beam range. That's really nice. Um, now, uh, let's go over the movesets now. All right, our beam gun is going to have 10 shots. Reload time is 13 seconds. So that's nice. A nice good 10 shots. Uh, sub 1 is a mega particle cannon. And that is the reload on that is 21 seconds. And then the funnels is going to be 38 seconds. And it looks like it's just one shot from that from by itself. But you get three of these. But the the reload time is pretty, pretty long. Now, let's see the ultimate. All right, now let's look at the uh, basic hits here. Let's see how many combos it has. One, two, three, has three, 
the heavy here, it's like a little tackle. The side slash it uses its uh, funnels and then the bounce up here. Yeah, you might be able to do something with that. Huh. That's cool, that's cool. Well, guys, uh, this is the K Gandam. Uh, any more requests in the comments, you know I got you guys. Other than that, if you, I really appreciate it if you guys stab that like button, stab that subscribe button, and I will catch you guys next time. Peace.